Hi guys! Hello everybody. Uh, my pillows are falling over on me. Sorry about the shirt. I am just getting comfortable. It's been kind of a long day. Um, so I'm just getting ready for bed kind of a little bit. Rocking a new head accessory today. I don't know. Am I rocking it or am I making it look stupid? I don't know. Let me know. Alright, so, my lovelies, my divas and divos, ladies and loss, I have some new stuff. Okay, so first of all, uh, the boots that I wore to my latest photo shoot for Valentine's Day. By the way, everybody, happy Valentine's Day. I hope you have a special someone with you. And if you don't, that's totally okay. You, pets and children count. And even if you, it's just you, you can always give yourself self-love because let's be honest. There are many versions of ourself. You know, me can love, I can love you. It's a whole thing. The thing that matters is as long as you feel loved. Anyways, moving on. So I wore these to my Valentine's Day photo shoot, which was my last one. Um, I need to schedule another one or find a new photographer, I'm not sure. Anyways. So, yeah. Oh yeah. These are knee-high boots. And look at that big chunky heel. And they lace all the way up in the back and half of a side zipper. I had to fight for these, let me tell you. Because I went in the shoe store and I was looking around for some heels because I need to start practicing on heels and I see these purple ones and I'm like, oh, I really want those. But I only had like $23 to my name at the time. <laughs> So, I, they said, oh, well, those are $30. I'm like, damn, really? Okay, so I found another pair of boots, kind of low cut, um, and I was just checking out, and silly me, I did not try them on. I know. So, by the time me and my boyfriend get, like, halfway home, I sit down and I actually try them on because he's like, those are not your size. I'm like, what are you talking about? I, I checked. Guys, I had a total blonde moment. Like, oh my gosh. So I thought <laughs> I was looking for a nine and I thought what I saw on the bottom of the shoe was a nine. No. It was a six. Yeah. My feet are way too big for sixes. Um, so I went back. We went all the way back down the hill. On foot. Walking. Exchanged them. Um, tried to find some other boots that were my size and within that price range. Or we were just going to walk away with our money. Um... Because I knew the shop owner so long, and I mean a long, long time, like, like 28 years, possibly longer, I'm not sure. She was talking to her daughter and she's like, you know what, she can have those boots for $23. 
Cause like she missed me. See guys, this is always good when you know a store and especially if it's a family owned business, if you know them and you communicate with them really well for a very long time, they will work with you. Like if you're so friendly at that shop for so long, you get discounts sometimes. And that's what happened to me. Like there was so much love and she missed my, not only my, my money and my, you know, service, that she just let me have the boobs. That, that is good salesmanship and that's a heart right there. That is a heart. So I wore these and I can't, they're kind of like a plum, color or like a I don't even want to say beet it's kind of a beet or a plum kind of purplish red um so yeah I got these just for my photo shoot and I did walk around them after that for a job interview which I nailed by the way and got the job but yeah that's a whole nother story so there's those. I love those boots. Next on the agenda, since this is a beauty and hair channel, I went back to Unbelievable, my local beauty supply and wig store. And I got a another 613. Curved part, ear to ear, lace front wig, iron safe, and this is also known as magic lace, which I love that because magical hair, um, yeah, the style is magic lace curved part. in 613 high heat resistant fibers it goes you can go from 200 degrees to 360 i i recommend you know i mean it depends on the style you're going with but look at this there's a picture and as you can see i've not taken out of the box yet so this Guys, girls, queens, when I say I splurged buying the, these two hair items today, I mean I splurged. But let's see how beautiful this lady is right here. Take her out of the box. You get the care instructions right on the back. Oh, yeah. Mm. So, right away, I notice she's kind of wavy. Um, she's not really thick, to be honest. But she has a nice middle part. It's, it's like a deep, deep middle part. I don't know if you can see that, but maybe if I turn it this way. See, like that. And then she has two combs in the front by the ears and one in the back, which I love. And it's a big comb and two adjustable strips. So she looks longer 
on the box than she does in real life. And she's very thin, you guys. Like, I'm, I'm not mad, but I'm a little disappointed because I paid $70 for this wig. Literally seventy dollars. Um, where's the? Oh, yeah, she was. Okay, so she was sixty four ninety nine. Um, she didn't come with any like wig caps or anything special like that, cause I I got it in a store and. The lace is somewhat soft. It's not super, super soft. But it's a little soft. Um, I might have to bleach it. But yeah, the lace is like a dark mocha brown. See? It's <laughs> I'm going to have to maybe bleach it. So there's that one. And I don't know if I'll color her or anything yet, but we'll see. Um, okay, so the next one, I was looking for something with color. I was looking for maybe a red and black one or a purple one, but I, I'm like, okay, a 613 and then something with maybe some color so she's pulling out burgundies she's pulling out purples she you know and she's like well we don't have any red and black or ombre or anything like that i'm like hmm, okay but i look over and there's two heads on the shelf and they have these like kind of short bob things but it's bright red like guys i will show you so this is a Swiss lace front wig, 100% heat resistance from True Wig. And that's what she looks like on the package, the style. Um, but she is in the color Auburn Red. However... <laughs> She's not Auburn. Like, I will show you guys. Oh, I don't want to cut this open. So, again, ear to ear, lace front. And I paid... Let's see, what did I pay for this one? So, this one was $60. It's more of a red wine color, honestly. It's not auburn. Um, I'm gonna try her on actually, cause I didn't actually get to do that. Oh my God. Oh my God, this is like, <laughs> oh my gosh. Guys, um, <sighs> there are no words, and honestly, I don't know what made me buy this wig. Like, you see how red it is. And frizzy it is. Um, let's see, what kind of parting is it supposed to be? Oh. Okay, so, and she comes in, this is the color NBS759. She also comes in purple. 
one, one B, two, four, platinum blonde. But I didn't see her in any color. I just saw her in this. Otherwise, I possibly would have just gotten the platinum blonde. Well, maybe not platinum blonde, but maybe like the purple. I don't know. I I I might sell this one, guys. Like I don't know what I was thinking. I was just kind of splurging and having fun with it. Um. Ugh. So again, dark brown lace. Home, and it is literally it is only the front where there's lace like this is oh wow this is totally transparent guys like you can see the tracks like <laughs> This was one of those spontaneous, crazy purchases. That's what this was. <laughs> I can't believe I paid $60 for this wig. Oh, it comes with tape. You guys, wig tape to tape it on your head. Like, oh my gosh. I've never actually tried this stuff before because I've been warned about it, but wow. But yeah, I don't know. Maybe it could be good for like maybe a costume or something like that but I just see and the thing that gets me is there's not really a parting like you'd have to make a part there's no part there's no side part there's no middle part um yeah I, if I don't sell her, I might straighten her. But yeah. So that it is. That is it for the weeks tonight. There's actually another one on the way because I made a bank account today again. And I ordered online. All I'm going to say is it's Harley Quinn. And I'm going to leave it there. Mm -hmm. All right, guys, my lovelies, my divas and devos, gents, and all the wonderful people. I hope you guys have a magical weekend, and I will see you next time.